Hey, what's up guys? Stock Android Tech here. Today, I'm going to be doing a video about an application called Pixel Widget. Now, I have been using this application, I want to say three, maybe four weeks. I wanted to test it out before introducing it to you guys to make sure there's no lag, there's no bugs, anything like that. So far, I want to give this application a five star rating, first of all. And there's only one flaw about this application that I do not like, and I will get into that very, very soon. So, this has 10,000 downloads, a 4.1 rating, and it has been recently updated of March 31st, 2017. Now, this application, if you want to go ahead and purchase the pro version, it's only 99 cents. I highly recommend doing so, and I'm going to show you why. So let's jump right into the application. When you first download the application, you're going to have the actual Pixel Pill widget look right here with the dates, the month, and the actual day. Now when you download the application and you go into your home screen, this is pretty much how it's going to present itself when you first open it up and you add the widget to your home screen. Now. This is what I don't like. This is the flawed with the application that I do not like. I do not like the gap right here that you're looking towards the edge of the screen. It just has a big gap. I don't like it. It looks stupid. So what I went ahead and did was I went ahead and I uh, purchased a pro version because, you know, when I was trying to change the look of the uh, logo itself, it wouldn't let me because it asked me to purchase the pro version. That way I can have more options to select a, a different logo for the Pixel Pill. And so when I went ahead and purchased that, I had a lot more options of what I can do to make it, to make it look the way I liked it. Um, so what I went ahead and did was in order to change the logo, just go ahead and tap on the Pixel Pill. And then these are your options you can choose from. I went ahead and just did the standard look without the gap right there. And then right here where it says Tuesday, April 4th, you can actually change that by clicking on it. And it gives you a different um, way of how it would look uh, to your liking. You can have it set to 25 Celsius. You can have it set to uh, 159 PM and so on and so on. So whatever you feel comfortable using, you can go ahead and do that. Again, this is not going to work. You can't design it the way you like it unless you purchase a pro version. Again, it's only 99 cents. Now let's move on right underneath where it says the logo. Um, you have an option to disable the top line of the text and you also have the option to disable the bottom line of the text. So if you were to turn them off, pretty much you're just going to get the pixel pill and that's what it's going to look like onto your home screen. Now as you can see, I am using my stock launcher right now. Um, I'm not using Nova or ADW, nothing like that. It's my actual stock launcher and it works perfectly fine on the stock launcher. Now if you're using Nova launcher or any other launchers out there, it will still work and if you decide to go ahead and open up the application you decide you want to go ahead and just select this actual logo for the pixel pill now let's just say hypothetically you're on Nova all you gotta do is just long press on the icon of the widget and just select padding and you can get it to sit fit perfectly on the side of the edge of your device so it doesn't look like there's an open gap right there but um, sometimes I, I I do prefer stock sometimes I prefer uh, Nova so I switch back and forth depending on what application I want to present to you guys when I'm doing a video so if you click on the pixel pill I have it set up to where it opens up Google now and it doesn't have that option where if you click on it you know it, you can uh, search automatically for for whatever you're looking for it doesn't have that I just didn't think it was uh, valuable at that time but I'm going to go a little deeper into this application if you go ahead and select uh, a logo for your pixel pill again I, uh, I went ahead and just chose this but now I'm going to go ahead and just choose a microphone and go back out. This is pretty much what it's going to look like. So you do get a lot of options when 
it comes to uh, selecting the logo uh, of your choice. And uh, for right now, I, I just really like uh, this basic pill. Now, again, you can turn on or turn off the top line of the text. Now, if you decide you want to keep one on, just go ahead and uh, enable that, whatever one you choose or both. And you can go ahead and select the date where it says Tuesday. And you can go ahead and just select what you like. Now, I already have shown you that, but now I'm going to show you the actual bottom line of the text. And I'm going to go ahead and disable the top line of the text. When you click on the month and the date, these are the other options that are giving you. So if you don't like the one that's already highlighted, you can go ahead and choose something else. And um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and just turn everything back on. Now, right here next to it, where it says top line text and bottom line text, you can go ahead and actually change the color of the month and then the day. So if you don't like the custom look, you can go ahead and change it to your liking. I went ahead and just stuck to this color for Tuesday. Now you can also change the background color and um, just go ahead and hit OK when you're ready to apply it. And originally when you download the application, the whole open Google Now Weather is not going to be enabled. So you want to make sure that if you do want to use the Google Now Weather, go ahead and enable that. And um, as far as the text input, the voice input in open Google Now, it's pretty much asking you what action is going to be completed when you're clicking on the Google logo. And that's when I chose the Google Now. So that's how you would implement that into the Google Pill when pressing on the actual logo. Now right here in the middle is completely blank where it says uh, Vidget Pro. Again, it's 99 cents. You can't actually customize the, you know, this actual um, Pixit, I'm sorry, Pixel Pill widget unless you purchase the Pro version. But um, other than that guys, that's roughly it. It's a very, very simple app to use. And you know, a lot of people out there that are not wanting to use uh, third party applications like Nova Launcher and and so forth and so forth and they want to stick to their uh, stock launcher and, and have the pixel pill widget well there you go you actually have it now for your stock launcher again it will work for third-party uh, applications if you decide you want to use a different um, a launcher per se so um, give this application a quick look at if you do like it I'll go ahead and leave a link in the bottom of the description box if you like this video hit that like button don't forget to subscribe guys you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram at technerd82 and also you can follow me on Google Plus right here where it says Android apps and customizations and also Android tech news and reviews but other than that guys you have a blessed day thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.